we just came across the actual Alfonso mango. And the, these are really hard to find here in Which Florida. No, it's right, it's no, right no, it's here. No. Where is it that where it says Alfonso? Look at this. Alfonso. <gasps> Back to our channel today is so exciting because i am taking you to the largest indian grocery store in all of the sunny state of florida and it is called the patel brothers guys this is going to be incredible each aisle is filled with authentic indian goods and you guys are going to let me know in the comments below if you recognize any of these ingredients so we're going to go inside i believe they even have in the back like a street food style uh, little restaurant so I want to try all of these amazing foods. I want to show you guys what this grocery store has to offer. And again, guys, the largest in all of the state of Florida. Let's go check it out. to several different like smaller Indian grocery stores but nothing as big as this look at all the colors and there's even things hanging from the aisles maybe there's some sort of tradition happening but wow this is definitely one of the best ones I've ever seen we're gonna make our way through because I also am gonna do another video where I'm gonna cook Malai kofta one of my favorite vegetarian dishes so I'm gonna get the ingredients here and uh, yeah, oh my gosh, there's so much to look at. <laughs> look at this. This is, looks like a big okra. They got so many things I've never seen before. Or even this one, look at this guys. It's like a spiky version and small. Okay guys, you will not believe it. We just came across the actual Alfonso mango. And the, these are really hard to find here in Which Florida. No, it's right, it's no, right no, it's this one. here. No. Where is it that where it says Alfonso? Look at this. Alfonso. <gasps> Alfonso, what do you think? This is incredible we literally like went on an alfonso mango hunt last year we could not find it it was only in the can i actually think i called this store to see if they had it they didn't now they have it you guys can let me know is this a good price 44 dollars a box okay not sure how many are in the box smell it smell it alfonso says smell it <laughs> i have to oh well it's wrapped up we can't see what it looks like but you want to buy? This is crazy. We need to buy it because your name's Alfonso and your name's Alfonso. <laughs> and everyone writes in the comments that Alfonso's the king of all mangoes. Yes. Yeah. So we're going to put this in. <laughs> Alright guys, so that was super nice. One of the... Um, the workers here came up and was like, oh, you're here, you know, take as many videos as you want. Let me know if you need anything. So we're gonna go through the aisles again. I'm gonna make Malai kofta. And yeah, I'm like stunned in here. I don't even know where to start. <laughs> All right, we discovered their spice aisle and there are millions of different kinds of spices here. I mean, so, so many. And one of the ones I needed was the whole cloves. And I remember I was telling you guys to let me know in the comments below, what is a clove? Well, here it is. So 
whole cloves is gonna be part of my Malai kofta recipe here, Alfonso. And where is the other one? Oh, I have cinnamon at home, but in a lot of the Indian dishes, they use like the actual sticks. Do you wanna show the camera that one? It's like an actual stick of cinnamon. So cinnamon. yeah, so we're gonna use um, some of that for our recipe. And do you guys know that name brand? Is it good? There's so many different name brands here. Here, Alfonso. And crispy fried onions. So we're gonna get some crispy fried onions. Again, this name brand, I guess it's all the same. There's a lot of different things here. Yeah, I'm still like, wow, there's so many things to choose from. Let's put this in the basket and let's continue our search so many things guys do you recognize any of this stuff <laughs> just came across we needed some paneer for the recipe and this even says malai paneer indian style cheese 100 percent vegetarian so maybe maybe i'll get the smaller one because yeah malai paneer so the recipe i need potatoes and cilantro here you go alfonso okay we're building up our recipe guys oh take a look at this Organic dosa batter. Authentic South Indian home style. Guys, there are so many things. There's so many things I don't even know what, what they are. But so many people here, right? Okay, let's continue. There's fresh coconut. So another thing I noticed about this grocery store is that on top here, it says the price of everything, but it also says the health benefits of it. Never seen that in like any grocery store ever. You see here the mustard seeds, or sorry, mustard leaves. It says like mustard greens are packed with energy boosting, heart healthy, disease fighting nutrients. It says it for each one, guys. See this one? They have broccoli, they have dill, like you don't see that at American grocery stores. So I feel like they really care about your health and nutrition here. So guys, we've been looking everywhere for this. It's a tally set, but it is steel, copper, and that was what we were looking for. Uh, something super healthy, super nice, enjoyable. We just found it at this store and we we've been really looking we were thinking of getting it online but we have it here let me know in the comments below if you think this is a good deal it's 55 dollars but i'm gonna get the whole thing and i want to make like a homemade tally um kind of vegetarian style uh dinner that's another video so you guys better hit that subscribe button if you want to stay tuned to all our videos so we're gonna take this Okay guys, we're about to check out. We got all of our things. We got more than what we thought. But when we were coming in, there's some samosas over there that smell super good. And they have samosas I've never even tried before. So we're gonna get this stuff and then we're gonna try some of their homemade samosas. <laughs> Love it. I made this from scratch. I made this from scratch. If you haven't seen that video, you gotta go watch it right now. <laughs> uh, 
All right, guys, so we just checked out and now we're at the Samosa Station. Take a look, guys. So they have a ton of them. They have the vegetarian. Look at this one. They have, I don't know. Oh, no, this is the potato samosa. Cheswan samosa. Paneer tikka samosa. What else? Chili paneer samosa. Um, and then this one. Sabundana Tika. Oops. <laughs> See, everyone is ordering samosas here. Okay, so I got my bag. I got like three different kinds. I'm not even sure which one I'm gonna start with here. Let's see. Look at that. Perfectly rolled samosa. Guys, and if you didn't know, I made my own homemade samosas. You gotta go check out that video. All right, let's see. Let's try this. Maybe I'll rip it open and show you guys. Ooh, that color. This looks like the potato samosa with peas. That is so good. Mmm. The potato is mer like perfect spices. Ooh, this one's spicy. I was gonna give some to Alfonso, but very spicy. I love spice, so for me, totally works. Mmm, mmm. I love the crispy bit. That is really, really good. You can even see the, I'm pretty sure that's one of those seeds, fennel seeds in there. Super tasty. Mmm. The corner bit is my favorite. Yummy. You guys usually tell me too. Okay, I'm gonna put some of this aside because I have two more samosas to try. Let's see what other one. There was a paneer samosa that I've never even tried before. Usually at the typical Indian restaurants in Florida, it's just vegetarian samosa. And maybe I had some sort of a chicken samosa, but a totally different place. Look at this one. Ooh, this smells really good. It smells like onions. Okay. Yeah, the cashier was so nice. The cashier gave Alfonso a little um, candy because he was, his name was Alfonso and we got the Alfonso mango. <laughs> okay, here we go. Ooh, what is this? What is this? This is like never seen before. Whoa, it smells like, like chili. It smells like Indo-Chinese samosa. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is good. Oh no. It's really spicy. <laughs> it's spicy. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god. Wow. It's like, it reminds me of that Indo Chinese flavors, those spicy ginger, onions but I don't even see any potato in here. Looks like onion, pepper. Maybe that is the paneer one. Oh gosh, that is really good. I'm gonna save this bite for Alfonso. Okay, next. Mmm, this is fun. Out of the grocery store, eating samosa. Okay, last but not least. Ooh. That looks good. Right. To me, it looks spicy. It has that little bit of a red. Can I, can I smell it? Alfonso wants to smell it. Oh, it's the, it's the one that we eat. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Ooh, what is this? This is shocking. Okay, because you know why it's shocking, guys? Because I only eat like the first one that I got with potato and peas. Like, that's just it for samosa for me. This is totally, I've never seen this before. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna love it. The smell is so good. That's one. That's one. Mm. Guys, that is so good. What is this? I gotta ask the, the guy over there. Let's give a little bite to Alfonso. Because 
This one doesn't taste spicy, but I don't know if it's because my mouth is on fire from the last samosa. <laughs> Alfonso, you ready? Want a bite? One, two, three. It's hot, by the way. It's, it's so like, good. It's really, really good. Oh my gosh, this is it. This might be my favorite. I don't want to go back to the potato one anymore. Potato one's boring. <laughs> this one is much better. Come with me. Oh, do you know what kind of samosa this is? It's vegetarian. They don't sell no meat in this one. Oh. So everything you eat is vegetarian. I wonder, they have names there. I wonder what Let me show you. Let me show yeah, because this one is so good. I've always had the other one where it's just potato. But yeah, this, this one I've never... Like, uh, probably a little bit of... I don't see any peas in there. But, but this might be cheese, right? Paneer? Paneer. Paneer, maybe. Yeah. And, uh, um, green chilies. Yes. And bell peppers. Oh, so maybe. This is ch uh, chili paneer. Yeah. Which one did you get? I think I. I, I you might have got the sage one. Is it, does it taste a little Chinese? -y? Oh, I had that one. That okay. one is the last one I had. Okay. This one it tastes, I think, more like this one. Chili, chili yeah. paneer. Yeah. Or paneer tikka. Paneer, but no, there's, I don't think. Does that taste potato or soft? Does it taste soft? Soft. So soft. That might be paneer tikka. Ah, this is my new favorite. But, um, this is uh, lilva, which is like, um, it's not peas, but they're like more like a flat peas. Oh, wow. So that's what that is. Wow, they're really tasty. You should get some on the way out. I make them. <laughs> oh, she makes her own. No, no you, you make your own. It's <laughs> even better. Homemade's better. Yeah, we have my kids like the, um, you know, the meat ones. Uh, right. So chicken or whatever, but I make them, so. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> well, thank you. Have a good day. <laughs> oh, Fonzo's addicted. Fonzo likes it. Whoops. <laughs> Guys, these samosas are so good. So pretty is gonna eat it and then that's about it. such a fun store. Look at all the stuff I got. <laughs> I got Alfonso mango. I got my own tally set for the first time. Alfonso's eating the other samosa. So guys, let me know what you think about this amazing Indian grocery store. Again, the largest in South Florida, guys. Stay tuned because the next video coming up, I'm gonna be making a Malai kofta with all the recipes. I'm gonna use my new tally set. And for the very first time, we're gonna be trying the Alfonso mango and Yes, when we get home, and we're gonna make the Alfonso mango lassi from scratch. Like this video, subscribe so we can continue making videos for you guys. And on that note, just keep on dancing.